You've chosen an avatar, written your script, set up your scenes, and even included some graphics and animations. Let's go over the steps now to generate and share your video. Before you hit the Generate button, preview your video by clicking the Preview button at the top right corner. Keep in mind that your avatar won't be animated when previewing your video, so focus on ensuring your script, pronunciation, animations, and other visuals are all in order. To preview a specific section of your script, drag the slider or put your cursor where you'd like to play from in your script box and hit the play button in a scene timeline. Edit your video as needed and preview it again after adding your finishing touches. Once you're satisfied, hit the generate button and name your file, choose the project folder you'd like to save it to, resolution, frames per second, and format. Then hit submit. While your video is generating, you can see the progress of your video generation on the project's page. While your video is generating, let's talk about how you can share your video. You can download the video file, or you can create a share page with a viewable link. If you'd like to share a link to the video, the video share page can be customized with your branding, and you can choose between sharing a collaboration link that allows commenting, or publish your video to create a public link that allows anyone on the web to watch a view-only version. Once your video has finished generating, click it again to access the share page where you can download it or customize the share page. Change the video's title or add a description below the video player. Click Customize your video share page to switch between light and dark mode. Upload a logo, change your video cover or thumbnail, and even customize the background for a premium branded feel. Click the Share button to copy the collaboration link. Choose between three access levels. Projects will give access only to that project folder's collaborators. Choose Team to restrict access to members of your HeyGen workspace or select anyone with the link. Let's choose anyone with the link, which will give anyone the ability to view the video, comment, and react, but they won't be able to adjust any other settings. Here from the Share page, you can also add captions by toggling on the Turn on Captions option. Captions will be based on your script, but you can edit them by clicking the Edit Captions buttons and uploading an SRT file or typing. Then, hit Publish Captions and wait a moment for them to generate. If you want to upload your video to another platform, simply click the Download button, select the resolution and toggle captions on or off, and hit the Download button. If you're creating a learning or training video and want to export a SCORM, toggle on this option, select the export version, and slide the slider to your desired completion criteria rate and click Export SCORM. SCORM exports are available on HeyGen Creator, Teams, Agency, or Enterprise plans. And lastly, you can even translate your video directly from the Share page. Head to the Translate tab, click Translate, and select your target language. You'll have the option to translate just the script as well as any on-screen text. We'll go further into translation features in a future lesson. And there you have it. Share your HeyGen video with your collaborators for feedback and reactions, enable captions, translate your video, download or export your video as SCORM and customize your share page. Congrats! And great work creating your first video in HeyGen. Join the HeyGen Hub to share your work, connect with other creators, and learn more in our resources and webinars.